Welcome to our tutorial on the input box function. In a situation where some input from the user is required, the program prompt dialog box can wait for user input and return the value as a string containing the contents of the dialog box. Some code here is similar to the message box code which we explored in our previous tutorial. We've got a message and a title. This expression displays in the text box as a default response. These values represent the horizontal and vertical distances from the top and left edges of the screen. This measurement is in TWIPS units. The word TWIP is an abbreviation for a twentieth of an inch point. This is a topographic measurement. In other words, it's one twentieth of a topographical point. One inch, by the way, contains 1,440 twips. A centimeter contains about 567 twips. Twips are a default unit of measurement in Visual Basic. This string identifies the help file. This numeric expression is assigned to the help topic in the help file. The return value passes to the result variable and the caption property of the label control. Let's see how it works. Let's run our program. The input box appears. Here's our title, the message, what is your name, and the default name, Mick. The user types an appropriate name. OK, and the label control is populated with the text entered by the user. This concludes our tutorial on the input box function.